I'm Shelley Duvall. Welcome to Fairy Tale Theater. Tonight's tale is a story of rags to riches, of a cat in breeches and boots, puss in boots, a story of bravery and ingenuity, inspired by the end of a broom. It all happened quite some time ago, in a land not so far from home. You see, there once was a miller who lived in a very small kingdom, a very poor kingdom, who after a lifetime of toil died of overwork and boredom. And to my eldest son, Edwin, I bequeath my mill. Oh, the mill. To my second son, Edward, I bequeath my mule. Mule. And to my younger son, Edgar, I bequeath my cat. The cat? Out of my sight, can't you see I'm brooding? Oh, master, I have a plan. A plan? A master plan. You're a stupid cat and a selfish cat. You're only saying that to prevent me from killing you, which I will do as soon as I get up from brooding. <laughs> you will never know when it's coming. My plan calls you to take me to town, Master. One day, when you least expect it, I will mangle you. <coughs> town? I'm sorry, excuse for a cat. Don't you know I've never been to town? I'm a miller's son. Town is out of my reach. Once I expressed a wish to go to town. I must buy finery, Master. Two words you have said which have no meaning to me. The first is town, the second is buy. I know not to buy. What do I have to buy with? Doesn't one need money in order to buy? And what is finally? A third word which means nothing to me. I have an idea. When you're asleep, I will strangle you. Yeah. Master. Dear master. Without a fine hat to cover my patchy crown where the goose struck. Without a fine suit of clothes to cover my tattered flanks where the mule kicks. Uh. Without a fine pair of boots to cover the bunions on my paws from a life of toil as a miller's cat, I cannot play the part. Come a little closer so that I can get my hands around your vile neck. What part? The part. The part I must play to carry out my plan. Oh, I hate your villainous plan. The plan that will catapult you to wealth and station beyond your wildest dreams. Dreams. A fourth word I do not understand. You leave me no choice. <laughs> Joyce. A fifth word. I will go to your brothers and catapult them to wealth and station. My brothers? You would go to my brothers? Alas. Don't shrug. I will not have the cat of my father's will shrug at me. Or side. But master. Or but me. You would dare go to my brothers? It's a good plan, master. Shut up, you stupid cat. Your life hangs by a thread. Before my brothers steal my plan, onward to town. <laughs> 